Okay, so the next in our pain-free series, we're going to look at the trapezius. Trapezius is an area where nearly everyone has problems, and it's due to postural issues, stress or overuse. So for example, if you carry a bag over one shoulder, if you're typing at the computer all day, or if um, you get stressed, the, the shoulders tend to tighten and you'll get knots in the area. So by trapezius, we mean the long strap-like muscle that goes from the top of your head um, to the sides of your shoulders and back, and it's a muscle that you can see just at the top of the shoulder and that sticks out. So th this gets problems in four areas. So here we've got a model of our shoulder. We've got our arm, which is here, clavicle, collarbone at the front, and we've got the scapula, the bone at the back, which is at the back here. So the scapula is just in here. So the four areas we get trouble in at the trapezius is one, just in, in this area near the neck, so where the, where the shoulder meets the neck, which is just in this muscle here. Two, the belly of the trapezius, which is the middle part here. Three, the lower border, so just on the bone and just off the bone. And four, just um, towards the top of the trapezius. So the thing about the trapezius is if you have problems in the trapezius, you won't necessarily get pain there. Uh, in fact, most likely you won't get pain there. So where will you get pain? Okay, so if you get a trigger point at trigger point one, which is there at the top, which is just where the neck meets the shoulder, so in here, I will get headaches and tension-like headaches. If I've got trigger points in trigger point two, which is the belly of the muscle, so just in there, and I can feel a knot there, if I get trigger points in there, then what that will cause is neck problems. Trigger point three, which is at the bottom of the scapula, if I get problems in there, what it will cause is shoulder problems and shoulder pain and shoulder stiffness. So in order to find that, turn behind me and it's just in here. So on the border of the scapula and just next door to it. And the last one, trigger point four, just at the top here, and if you've got knots in there, which is just in here, what that will cause is burning like pain in between your shoulder blades. So if you're getting any of those symptoms, you've probably got trigger points in your trapezius. And in order to get rid of them, you need to massage into them. And you can do this yourself. You need to repeat the massage, hold it for 60 seconds and repeat every two hours. So you're not trying to kill the knot in one go, you're trying to stimulate the body's own healing process. So just to give you examples of how you can do that for trigger point one, you can use a pencil like grip here in between the neck and the shoulder and I can squeeze. I can find the knot and hold that for 60 seconds. You'll know when you're on the knot because it'll be very painful and it will refer pain into the area you're getting. So for me, that's going up towards the back of my head. Okay, next one into the belly of the muscle and I can squeeze in there or I can have a ball behind me on a wall and lean into that and apply pressure from the front as well like so, and third one, in here, I can lean on a ball against the wall and apply pressure onto that for 60 seconds, and the same with the knot here, I can lean on a wall uh, with, with pressure against that area for 60 seconds as well.